Welcome to the Male Authority. Um, today I'm just going to be talking about that show Whale Wars. All right, I was watching TV the other day, and uh, I came across the show, and I have to tell you guys, it is just absolutely hilarious. I mean, if you had a competition of how many dumbasses you could fit onto one ship, they would totally win it. Um, I have some clips for you guys um, that I cut out of their one of their YouTube things. Uh, you have to check it out, and uh, yeah, let's have a look. Do everything we can to shut down their whaling operations non-violently. Non-violently, by the way. Um, this includes, you know, like maybe with a megaphone yelling at them, stop the whales. That's what it would mean. If you had a protest on the street, a non-violent protest, that's what you're doing. But uh, this is what falls under their definition of non-violently, yeah. We have this well, one chemical, butyric acid, we throw it onto the deck. More scoops of methicillin in a paper bag that we've packed pretty tight. Goes under their deck, breaks open, there you have it. Just chase them. They're running, they're not whaling. Excuse me, are you guys fucking nuts? Throwing uh, acid onto the boat and soap and shit and trying to tie up the propellers and chasing them. Uh, not non-violent, okay, first of all. And second of all, dude, it's ridiculous. This reminds me of when you go to the park, okay, and you see the dog park and you see the people with their animals. And then there's that small chihuahua raising hell, fucking going after one of those big-ass mastiffs or uh, rottweilers. It's like, dudes, who are you kidding, okay? First of all, you're in international waters and you're going to screw with these guys? If I was the Japanese, I would sink those suckers, man. I mean, they are so moronic. And what the Japanese are doing is totally legal, okay? So, whatever. Hey, and check this out. Come down here and you kill innocent whales, but if anybody comes after you, you run like cowards. Okay, two things wrong with that. First of all, since when are whales fucking innocent, okay? Uh, what's the difference between a whale and the chicken that we pick up at the grocery store? That was not an innocent creature, but the chicken was bad, so we fucking killed it, and now we're going to eat it. Uh, what's the deal, okay? Um, cows, are they uh, evil? They're not innocent, so we can k eat, kill and eat them? Uh, yeah, not going to... What the fuck is this deal with that? And then the second th thing is uh, we chase you and you run like cowards. Um, well... You're uh, harassing them, and also, what do you want them to do? You know, you want them to turn around and frickin' shoot you, or, or ram you with the boats, or wh what? And um, another major point is, dudes, who are we to say that whaling is a bad thing? Um, that it's immoral, and we can't do it, and whales are sensitive creatures, and you know, all that bullshit. Guys, this is a cultural thing. They've been eating whale for hundreds of years. That's like... That's almost as crazy as if everyone, like the Indians came over here, and I'm not talking about Native Americans, I'm talking about Indians from India, you know, Buddhists, uh, and would say to us, hey, you guys, uh, those cows, innocent fucking creatures, not to mention holy, okay? How can you guys eat and kill them by the millions? Um, yeah, different cultures, different, different strokes for different folks. And uh, for us to go up there and... S tell them to stop whaling is just totally ridiculous and uncalled for and th the Japanese have every right to do it and they also uh, pretty much have every right to tell the whales to jog on and uh, I don't understand man if I was a whaler I would totally fuck these anti-whalers up and uh, yeah let's look watch this two members of our crew that you have on board your vessel you're detaining illegally I'm making a complaint of kidnapping against the Japanese Japan is refusing to hand over two protesters who boarded a whaling ship in the southern ocean we're here to harass the whalers and let them know that they can't do their acts without someone paying attention um, hello you dumbasses jumped onto the boat you boarded illegally um, how retarded, you know, you fucking jump onto somebody else's boat and then you expect them to give you right back to the person you came from so that they can do it again? It's so stupid. If I was the Japanese, not only would I not give those fuckers back, but I would fucking give them a good show Minucci on that boat, man. I would give them a nice little shellacking. If you jump onto my boat after you've been throwing acid and soap and bullshit on it all day, I'm gonna fucking kick your ass, man. That is ridiculous. You know, these whalers are... Have every right to do it, and then oh, you're holding somebody illegally. Uh, 
no douchebags, you know, you guys boarded illegally, okay? And um, this other asshole saying that, oh, you know, we're here to harass the whalers. Uh, you guys are so moronic, man. And I wish if I had, I mean, a ridiculous, obscene amount of cash, I would buy myself a, a, my own few boats, okay? And I would go out there and be an anti-anti-whaler. So I would be against the people who are against whaling. I would say, why don't you shut the fuck up and go home and let these guys do what they need to do. Because it is just ridiculous. And I mean, on these boats, these, uh, they have now, I think, like three boats. These uh, wha anti-whalers, the whale watchers, the whale wars guys. Uh, I mean, talking about a boat full of morons. <laughs> Watch this. It's like a big game of Battleship yeah. when you think about it. fucking retarded. First of all, that statement is bullshit because you guys are the only ones doing anything aggressive, okay? And uh, if we would validate your statement, would it would mean that the whalers would actually fight back, in which case you would lose your big bang game of battleship, <laughs> and then you would be butt-fucked, okay? So, uh, at the end of the day, I think it's totally ridiculous what these whale war people are doing. First of all, they have no right to do it, okay? Second of all, the cultural factors, it just gives them, you know, it just makes it more of a reason why they shouldn't be doing it. And then, I mean, the bunch of morons that they have on this boat starts with that captain dude. I mean, this guy is so full of shit. I mean, he is gushing out of him. You know, and then that fucking second mate, the ugly one with the mustache thing going here and then the patches of beard here. It's like, dude, what the fuck? Are you as stupid as, as you are ugly? Jesus Christ. And then you have all those dumb chicks on there. Oh yeah, we like to save the whales, like a big game of battleship. Don't hurt the whales. Oh, but we like to eat the hamburger. Whales are innocent, cows are not. You know, I had enough of it, man. It's fucking bullshit. Anyway, that pretty much wraps it up for me, um, the male authority, Dave, here. Uh, I'm going to have some more of these shows, because I also watched the show on MTV. Oh my god, don't even get me started. Ridiculous. You got those pregnant teen moms, and then you also have that other one, that high school shit. Like, uh, if you knew who I, wa who I was or some bullshit like that. Uh, anyway, I'm going to get on those shows too and uh, tell you why they're full of it, if you don't already know. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much wraps, up, wraps it up for me. This is the male authority. Remember, it's a man's world, not a whale's world.